Welcome back. It is Hispanic Heritage Month, and as the contributions of Hispanics are being celebrated nationwide, one woman is at the top of her political career. In fact, in just two generations, a local family went from working the fields to serving in the U.S. Senate. This is the story of Nevada Senator Catherine Cortez Masto. Okay. Catherine, left hand in the Bible, raise okay. your right. Catherine Cortez Masto made headlines after winning her bid to replace Senator Harry Reid, making her the first Latina ever to serve in the U.S. Senate, a title she does not take lightly. It is one thing to make history, but it is now, it's another for me to be, uh, have a seat at the table and be able to use my voice for others who are traditionally underrepresented. That you take this oath and obligation freely. When she arrived in Washington, she quickly realized there was work to do, broadening the ethnic base. I sat down with my staff and I said, oh my God, we, we got to do something about it. we got to shake this place up. So, as a junior senator, she set out to bring diversity to not only her office, but to others on Capitol Hill. They brought together minority government workers to discover what barriers were holding them back and urged them to support each other to build their careers. Plus, she'd like to see government interns get paid so those coveted jobs can be open to students of all backgrounds. People think of diversity, think it's a checkbox, right? Oh, I hired that. I hired that Latino. I hired that African American. I'm done. That's not what this is about, right? This is about changing that culture. This is about every single day. The granddaughter of a Mexican immigrant, Cortez Masto, heavily identifies with many of her constituents. The struggles her family faced are the same ones they face. Every day I walk through the, the halls of Congress, or even when I was attorney gen general here, I think of uh, the courage it took for my grandparents to, to come to this country and the hard work that it took for my parents to make sure that their two daughters would be the first in our family to graduate from college. A native Nevadan, Cortez Masto is the daughter of Joanna and Manny Cortez. Her father, the longtime head of the Las Vegas Convention and Visitors Authority, and he also served as a Clark County Commissioner. Her dad of Mexican descent, her mom of Italian, which made for some large family gatherings. So one Sunday, I'd be at my Mexican-American grandmother's house having uh, frijoles and tortillas that she made and her tamales and you name it. And, and then the next Sunday, I'd be at my Italian grandmother's and she made a pot of sauce, right? And we'd have brujol and lasagna and you name it and uh, meatballs, all the great food. Those Sunday dinners and rich cultural background help shape the woman she is today. But she also credits dedicated mentors for opening doors in her life. Now she hopes to kick those doors wide open for others to follow. It is the opportunity to open that door even wider, mm -hmm. to make sure that not only that I have gone through, but others are coming behind me and I'm pulling them through and helping them through. Great story. And I don't know if it's dinner time, but hearing about Italian and Mexican food, I'm on board. <laughs> and a pot of sauce. Yeah, <laughs> okay. me too. Is it dinner time? <laughs>